7.16 a.m. on a Saturday morning. We need to like get going. What's up guys? I'm here with Tori and Hi. we are getting ready for BeautyCon. Mm -hmm. And um, so we were like, let's do a get ready with me. But naturally, you know what we have to do before we get to BeautyCon. What are we doing? We're going to Dry Bar and we're getting blowouts. Obviously, because that's what we have to do. So it looks like we're both putting a moisturizer. I love that moisturizer. I love this one. It smells so good. Mm -hmm. So I forgot a foundation because, oh my god, my voice. <laughs> Danny and I were gonna self tan last night, but literally she got in at like 12.15 and I got in at like 12.30 from the style hall party. And we were like, it's just not happening. Like we can't, I like brought, I bought three bottles of self tanner so we would have like a selection. And we're just Stop. like, no, it's just not happening. Like we couldn't do we it. We would have had the streaks beyond streaks if we did last night because we were so tired. We were so tired, we would have went right into bed. So we couldn't oh, yeah. have done it. So because of that, I didn't bring a pale foundation. I only brought this dark one from Hourglass that fun, people yeah. rip me apart about. Last night at the Soho party, CoverGirl gave out these foundations and this is lighter than the other one and it's all I have to work with right now. So I'm gonna make it work because I we can, can do it. it Sing it, girl. <laughs> we do. I have allergies. I have me too. Allergies. That's also a thing. My nose is like running. Mm-hmm. That was me yesterday. No, it's just like all stuff, so. Yay! Yeah, I woke up. <laughs> I woke up with this stuff in this too. Oh, crazy. So exciting. Okay, so this is definitely like a little too dark for me. Do I know times I put on foundation and it's way too dark? I'm like, well, I'll just blend to the neck and call it a day. Honestly. <laughs> Can't stop using this Smashbox. Oh, you could've used this. Oh, I could've used that. Whatever. I didn't think about that. I'll be that. tan I'm sorry. Um, the Smashbox Studio Skin 15 Hour Wear Foundation. It's great. It really lasts about at least 12 hours because like I'll go to school at like, like, we get ready at like 6 30 and then sometimes i don't even get home like when i would have rehearsal like i wouldn't even get home till um like eight so that's longer than 12 hours so that's about well it's about 15. so danny i have to ask how would you manage it all <laughs> because like yeah. you guys know how much she does <laughs> No, and I just honestly want to know how you do it all. Yesterday, actually, if you guys watched my senior day vlog, I kind of, like at one point I laughed at myself because it was like the end of the school day and I ran to my school's bathroom. My mom handed me my bag and I changed for my flight to New York. And at that moment, I was like, Mom, how do I do this? How am I doing life? Like, I literally, like, I sometimes I don't know, but I think it's just like, I really enjoy doing a lot of different things mm -hmm. and like being a, like, in high school, like, I don't know, I just like to be involved, like, I don't want to miss out, so somehow I just figure out, I'm like, you know what, I just won't be able to breathe today, but, like, if I can, if I'm enjoying everything I'm doing, like, it's worth it for me, if that makes sense. No, that's good advice. But, like, other than that, I don't really know. I do a lot of planning, a lot of day designering. And you still have time for a social life. Yeah, sometimes though, but sometimes my friends get mad at me because like I'll ditch them on a Friday night to go home and film. Mm, I've done that too. But like it's, it's part of your like if they sometimes <laughs> they have like a shift. I know. Sometimes your friends have like a, a shift of work from like four to nine. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So it's like we have jobs. Joel tell you this? No, didn't um, tell you that. Joel last summer, our manager told me because he was like, I was like struggling to figure out how to balance between well, oh, I think Joel Josh, between social life and. um you know, YouTube, and he was like, think of it like a lot of your other friends have jobs, and they go from like four to nine. Oh my god, why are you all that? I know, that, that's, that's weird, I thought he like, told you that. Yeah, he didn't tell me this. And he was like, just pretend it's like your summer job. I'm getting hot, actually. Yeah, I might be starting to sweat off my makeup a little bit, but I don't uh, want to say anything in case you were enjoying me. No, no, I was not, but I liked the view better. Sorry, guys, we just, that had to happen. This is the only concealer I've ever used since I found it, the basic. I love that one. one. Really interesting. It really is like one of the best concealers. <gasps> okay, so that's maybe, walking. Maybe we should finish our like. Guys, we're really good at planning. Okay, why don't we do our base, go yeah. do our hair, and then yeah. we'll come back and finish. Easy. Whenever I put on loose powder, I like lean over like this because I don't want to get on my clothes. Wait, that's a good idea. I like never used to use loose powder unless it was to bake, but like recently I've just been using it to set. Just for like mm -hmm. funsies. What are you using? Oh, the this RCMA. is RCMA. I like swear by it. Are you doing your eyebrows? I kind of want to just do my eyebrows. Okay, wait, you're iconic. I'll do them too. Can we just do our eyebrows? Yeah, we can set And then our just eyebrows. not do like 
contour and all that. Yeah, we'll okay, do that cool. when we get back. So almost, you're, we're about to leave you guys, but then we'll be back with blowouts. My favorite eyebrow was my left eyebrow, but now it's switched <laughs> to my right eyebrow. Hey okay, guys. Do you want this? It helps. Fix pause, yes please. Oh my god, this reminds me of my attempted beauty gear, like, like <laughs> when I tried to be a beauty girl. When I tried to do makeup tutorials, like when I was in like 8th grade and I was doing silky eye. When did you start? 8th grade? June 24th, 2010. Oh. So, 8 like, years ago. So, like, 5th grade? 4th grade? 5th grade? Yeah. I've been, yeah, I've been chilling for a while now. Wow. So, we're gonna go ahead to dry bar because we don't have time to finish our makeup. We'll be right, right back. back. We'll be back. Cure. Cute hair. QR cute hair. And we're back. Yay. And better than ever with well, blowout. I, I fixed my blowout. She fixed her blowout. She wasn't too happy. She wanted a little curlier. Yeah. I'm, it was like, I mean, it looked like a blowout. <laughs> Which yeah. was like good. But like she didn't want If that. you wanted to blow out, like it would have been amazing. But like I wanted loose curls. Yeah. But at least she didn't do super tight curls. Yeah, she didn't do them tight, thank God. So yeah, so now we're gonna do the rest. Um, I bought this at the airport yesterday, so I'm happy I'm drinking this now. It's a Starbucks refresher. That's so sad. Why? Check in now for your flight. That's so depressing. Oh my god, for your flight tomorrow. Yeah, how depressing is that? <laughs> Wait, I'm so happy I am not a flight. Do you watch David Dobrik? I didn't until playlist. No, me either. And then right after playlist, He's I He's so watching. funny! I will sit down, I'm like, okay, one David Dobrik vlog, one. Literally, I waste like two hours on his vlogs. I'm like, because <sighs> they're all four minutes. You're like, I can, I have four more minutes. Like, I can watch no, four more minutes. No, he's very smart in that. I know. Minutes. No, he's so smart. And like, at first, like, Joey would be watching them, and I'm like, what is that stupid thing you're watching? Because I just hear like a ton of screaming, and I'm like, I don't know. I just like wasn't attracted to it yeah. until I sat down and like watched it myself, and I was like, this is so funny. No, like so funny. they all just sit around every day at this place and just do funny things. They are so funny. And like how they come up with so many funny things to do. Like I applaud them. Beats me. But all I think about is food. Like I'm not kidding when I say that. Like, yeah, that's totally fine. It's all I think about. Like every time I leave my house, I'm like, what if I get hungry? Like what am I gonna eat? I bring bars a lot. Joey's awake. It's so funny because like I wake up for school so early, so like Joey won't even text me till like halfway through my day. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of funny. It's like, wait, oh my god, I have a story. So there's this there was this guy that I really liked in middle school, mm -hmm. and when I had a crush on a boy, like I was obsessed with a boy. Like I don't know if you can tell from me being obsessed with Toddy, mm -hmm. but like I am obsessed with. No, I I have my fair share. So um. There was this guy that I liked. His name was Brian, and he knows this because of the story I'm about to tell you. Brian Ruby Singh was his name. Hi, Brian. <laughs> and um, I like had this really big crush on him, and he was dating this girl, Natalie, mm -hmm. who's now my best friend, which is really funny. Uh, but like we weren't friends then. Yeah. So he was dating this girl, Natalie, and like I knew that. But <laughs> I was I don't know why we were talking. I think we were playing like the question game. And he was, middle school, this is middle school. Yeah, this is middle okay. school. Just this is sixth grade. And he was like, "So, like, do you have a crush?" And it was him. And I didn't want to tell him. And I was like, "No, like, I'm, I don't like anyone right now." And he's like, "That's a lie. Like, I know you like someone." I'm like, "Yeah, I do like someone." And he's like, "Who?" I'm like, "I can't tell you." And then he's like, "Well, what do you think about your crush?" I'm like, "I think about my crush." All the time, like he's all I think about. And I literally went and on like looking at him, like little does he know. No, and then he was like, "Am I your crush?" And I was like, "Yeah." So I literally just told him that I think about him all the time, that I'm like in love with him. Who are you with? Just him. <laughs> Why are you guys alone? We were, we were. It was a bathroom break. So we were standing in line for the bathroom. You guys have bathroom breaks? Yeah, because we weren't allowed to go during class time. Oh my god, I think I'd cry. I pee like every other day, or every other day. Every other day. I pee every. That's a little concerning. <laughs> I pee every other minute. That's, that makes sense though, because like the amount of times I've gone to the bathroom during class just to pass time is pretty funny. I know, it's just mm -hmm. like annoying how mm -hmm. you can't do your own thing with the bathroom though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we were in line for the bathroom, played the question game, mm -hmm. and um, all the beans were spilled. Have you ever, I'm sure this is like obviously basic, but like the amount of people, I've probably had like four or five girls that are like, 
will like Facebook message me like, hey, like, remember we used to be like best friends in middle school? Like, I love your YouTube now. And I'm like, you never talked to me. Wait, no, that never happened to me. Really? Oh my God. Well, cause like, I like always was like, like when I did like hip hop and stuff, I was friends with these like older girls. Well, I wasn't really friends with them. I wanted to be their friend. And they were like four years older than me. But they were like, no. And they were like, yeah, they just like didn't get a tower day. And like, yeah. I knew that because like. You're younger. Cause I'm younger. Yeah. And um. You weren't cool yet. Yeah. <laughs> I had a short bob with bangs, like, you know, and, oh, wait, um, I would kill to see a picture. Oh, I'll find one. Like, I literally, like, this is funny. No one ever believes this. Like, especially at my high school, because at my old school, I went to there from pre-K to eighth grade. Yeah. But, like, I was such a tomboy. Like, there was one point in really? my life. Yeah. No one ever believes it. There was one point in my life where I literally was going to get, like, my, you know, haircut, and I asked the lady if I could get a guy haircut. Like, literally, like. Yeah, like a boy. And yeah, my mom I would never guess. Yeah, my mom like lets me like do my thing, but I remember that time she was like, Danielle, like, I'm not letting you do that. I was like seven maybe. And she, so the lady was just gave me the shortest bob haircut you could possibly get. And I was like, Oh, it's not boy enough, but I'll take it. Wait, what what did you mean by boy? Like what did you want? I wanted like like a pixie cut. Okay. But I didn't know that word. Girls get pixie cuts. I'm so happy. Next week I can finally get my eyebrows waxed again. I haven't been able to because of Accutane. Look at my eyebrows. I haven't gotten them waxed in maybe two years. I hate you. No, like look at- <laughs> I hate her. Her no, eyebrows look so good. Look at all this hair underneath is what I'm saying. Like I can hardly see need them. to Mine's get Mine's always like right here and I like try to tweeze, but I'm so bad at tweezing. That's why I always get my eyebrows done. You can't get your eyebrows waxed on Accutane? No. Why? Because it rips off your skin. Because it makes your skin like extra dry. So <laughs> what do you want to do in 10 years, Danny? For me, like, I would love, like, like, I don't ever want to have, like, a standard job. Like, I don't want to be, like, I don't, like, I want to be my own employer, if that makes sense. Like, no, I so want, I'm, I feel like you're probably the same way. I'm the same one. Like, I really want my own brand of some sort. Like, I would love to have my own clothing line. Like, that's, like, really cool. Or, like, or open my own store, like, a boutique or something. Or something just have my own brand. And then also, like, my goal is to be kind of, like, a Lord Conrad in that sense. Where yeah, she is, like, you, you know, writes a book like speaks at women conferences, you know, was on a TV show, like just like doing a ton of different things because like I get really bored, not bored, but like, you don't want to be in a rut. I don't want to be in a rut and I like doing different things because I like taking on new challenges, aka like why my senior year was so crazy. Like I literally was like, you know, in a musical, a football manager, like a leadership position at school, like doing YouTube, like I just, I like, you know, doing a ton of different things, but like I would love to obviously be doing a ton of different things in the same like category. So like having to do with fashion and inspiration and lifestyle like all that fun stuff like that's what I want to do like ever since I was little I found this like like I, a drawing that I drew like forever ago and it was like I want to do something that I love like I just like for my whole life like I knew since I was young that I wouldn't do something that I didn't love to do because like there's so many times like even when you go to like the dentist you know <laughs> and the dentist is just like so not happy with their lives like I want to go to work every day or do whatever I'm doing and like love it <laughs> so that's just like whatever that is <laughs> Tori money is what worth being unhappy exactly what about you um, I want to be a mom no I want to be a mom and I want to have my own spin studio Boom, done. Oh, looks good! Yay! Yay! Yes, it is mine. So that Yay. is it for this Get Ready With Me. So on Tori's channel, we did a Get Unready With Me. Well, we're gonna uh -huh. tonight. So that's always really fun. So you'll see us take all of our makeup off and wind down for the day. So I'll have Tori's video and channel link down below. Make sure to subscribe to her. She's amazing. She's been posting a lot lately and she's super healthy and fun. You've been Love posting her. a lot lately. We both have. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> Joel. Yes, we love you, Joel. I love you guys so much, and we'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye. -bye.